Hey guys, how's it going? Ricky here along with Sean Anderson continuing our our keys for college football this week. <laughs> I, I wanted to, I wanted to the say keys, I, I wanted to say picks. You guys aren't morons. I wanted to say picks. You guys but aren't morons. These you. are our keys. You got a good SEC matchup, an 8-9 matchup. The number 9 Tennessee Volunteers who got Lady Luck on that side and then number 8 the Shocking Texas A&M Aggies, who we all thought Kevin Sumlin would be on the hot seat by this time. But Ricky, why do I have this game? Why? Why do? Why do you think I have this game? It's because you really hate. don't want my blood pressure you being high. Hate the Vols. No, I, okay. We were watching. Okay. The, we were watching okay. the end of the Georgia game. We were, or we were listening to his I don't ESPN. Hate them. I just hate how lucky you get because you <laughs> should lose. You should lose some games. ESPN doesn't have the didn't have the the watch ESPN stream on, so we were listening to the game. So we listened to the touchdown Dobbs through, and Ricky threw a fit. It was fantastic. So I'm doing it so Ricky doesn't have to think you about it. You should have lost against Appalachian State. Anyways. So the keys for Tennessee is to get out. My glasses. Okay, go ahead, Sean. <laughs> the keys for Tennessee is to get out to a fast start, so Ricky's blood pressure doesn't get boiling. But if you don't get out to a fast start, which you're most likely not going to do, it's don't turn the ball over because Dobbs 13 to six. That's not a good ratio. You need to keep the ball in your hands because a team against te- a team like Texas A&M is going to make you pay if you turn the ball over. Dobbs needs to be efficient. He doesn't. He, he can't. He can't turn the ball over a game because if you mm-hmm. if you don't get out to a fast start against Texas A&M, they are not going to let you have it back. Texas A&M is that good of a team, and that's what good teams do. They close out. Tennessee has to prove that they are a good team. I'm not saying they're not because I, I have them high ranked, but I'm just saying that Tennessee needs to shut the door or at least you know stay get out to an early lead or at least. Get out to a fast start and be matching up with Texas A&M because if Texas A&M gets out to a fast start and takes a 14-point lead, you're not going to see that one back. But Tennessee does have Lady Luck on their side, and that's definitely going to be a big part. Texas A&M pressure Dobbs, make him throw that those interceptions. That's going to be the key there. Is put pressure on Dobbs, make him force force him to make mistakes, make him look scramble out there, make him look very pressured and worried. And if you do get out to a fast start and you do put pressure on him, you're going to win this one. I'm going to pick Tennessee just because they do have Lady Luck on their side. I think Texas A&M is probably going to win the game because it is at home. They will be having the home field advantage. They will be having the 12th man. But Lady Luck is a powerful thing, and I'm going to take them by three. The line is seven for Texas A&M. They're getting seven points. I don't think they're going to get it. Even even if you don't want the Vols to win, I would still take the Vols if you're going to bet on it. I will take the Texas A&M. Or no, I'm taking the Tennessee Vols by three. Yeah, I mm, seven points is ridiculous. I hope Texas A&M wins this one just because. Uh, well, what if Tennessee gets out to a fast start and they win? What if they look? Like good. If you look like what you're supposed to, then fine, I can forgive it. Five you should have lost to Appalachian Five State. And You've been getting lucky, and I know in the end it's, well, Ricky, we won the game. That's all that matters. They're 5-0. and up. But let us know down below. What are your keys for the game? Who do you got winning? Check out our Patreon page. We want to get lapel microphones. We got some cool ideas like uh, playing a little pickup basketball between us. And so. also check out Patreon because I used Tinder and I freaked the fuck out because yeah. it, t- it was scary. Yeah, he did. It was, was kind of funny, but... Uh, <laughs> Check that out, Patreon. The link is right there. I want to thank you guys for checking out this video. Check out all our other. We love you guys. All our other college football keys videos. And as always, have a good day, everybody.